वंदे गुरुपद्वंद भक्त बिंदु समित श्रीचैतन्य प्रभु वंदे नितानंद सहोदित श्री नंद नंदन वंदे राधिका चरणोदय गोपीजन सयुक्त बिंदावन मनोहर वाछाकल्पतरुश की पास सिंधु व्यवच पति पावने वैष्णवेभ्यो नमो नम मुकोति वाचाल पंगुंग लंघयति गिरी झत्की पातमहंग बंदे परमानंदमाधव बिंदाओ तुलसी देव वही पिया वही केशव सच कृष्ण भक्ति पदे देवी सत्यवत्व नमो नम नारायण नमस्कृत नर चरोत्तम देवी सरस्वती व्यास तथो जयो मुदीर संकीर्तने कृष्ण कथोपदेश गौरीय पत्रश प्रकाशने सदाक्त गुरु भक्ति युक्त भक्ति प्रमोदाक्ष जगोदर धेय सदा परिभवन भविष्य दोहम तीर्थास्पद शिव विरचनुत शरण्य भेतात्म बनुतपालीपोथ वंदे महापुरुष ते चरणारविंद यत्दपल्लवनकचंदमनीय विस्फुजीत कि दूषदर्श पूर्णागरसागर सारूर्ति साराधि कामय कदा श्रीकृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभुनंद श्री अद्वैत गदाधर शिव सदी गौरभक्तबिंद श्री कृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभुनंद श्री अद्वैत गदाधर शिव सदी गौरभक्तबिंद हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे आजानुलंबित भुज कनका बुदात संकीर्तन कवितर कमलायुताक्ष भीशाबर द्विजर जुगधर्म पाल वंदे जगत प्रिय करो करुणा हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे नमा गंगे तव पाद पंकज सुरासुरवंदी तो दिव्य रूप भुक्ति मुक्ति दधासी नीतम भावान्ेन्न सदा नरा गंगा तरंगरमणीय जटाकलाप गौरी निरंतर विभूषी तवाम भाग नारायण प्रिय मनंगमदापहार वाराणसीपुरपति भज विशनाथ वागीशजुष वदने लक्ष्मीजस् चक्षसी यस्ते हृदय संबी निशिंगम भजे हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे हरे 
हरे राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे प्रिय प्रिय स्वयं कृष्ण सहचरी कुरुक्षेत्र मिलित शा अहम राधा तदीदम संगम सुखम तथापि अंत खेलत ममो मधुर मुरली पंचम जूसे कालिंदी पुलिने विपनाय स्पृहयति प्रिय स्वयं कृष्ण सहचरी कुरुक्षेत्र मिलित शा अहम राधा तदीदम संगम सुखम तथापि अंत खेलत मम मधुर मुरली पंच पंचम जूसे कालिंदी मनो में कालिंदी पुलिन पुलिन विपिनाय स्प्रिय मनो में गौरीय गोष्ठीपति शिशिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपाद परमांश जगदगुरु सेट दैट माथुर विरह ब्रजवासी देय सेवा इज अवर टारगेट माथुर विरह ब्रजवासीगण सेवाई हमें लक्ष्य गौरव गोष्ठीपति श्रीशील भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी जगत प्रभुपाद परमांस जगदगुरु सेट दे माथुर विरह ब्रजवासी देयर सेवा इज अवर टार्गेट एक्चुअली कंटिन्यूस सेवा अब गुरु वैष्णव कैन मेक मी फ्री फ्रॉम बॉन्डेज प्रभुपाद मेनी टाइम यूज टू से बट हेयर सम स्पेशल थिंग इफ यू कैन सर्व प्योर गुरु वैष्णव हंड्रेड परसेंट गारंटी बाई योर पर्सनल एफर्ट यू कैन नॉट काट योर मेटेरियल बॉन्डेज यू कैन ट्राई योर बेस्ट टू गो आउट ऑफ माया बाई योर पर्सनल एफर्ट यू कैन ट्राई योर बेस्ट बट देर इज नो स्योरिटी देर इज नो स्योरिटी you can come out successful many such cases we have seen that they fall down again somebody is speaking i am already out of maya somebody going to demand i am already out of maya Sila Prabhupad asking, "You are out of Maya. You are going to, you are going to demand. You are going to demand that you are out of Maya. You are successful to get victory over Maya. How possible you are speaking this way?" even shankar bhagwan brahma all big big manirishi they never they never speaking this way well we are successful to get victory over maya nobody speaking how you can speak like this how you can speak like this because bhagwan speaking momo maya duratya nobody can cut nobody can go out of maya without my kripa my kripa mean sadhu kripa my kripa mean sadhu kripa because bhagavat kripa coming through guru vishnu mame boje prapadante maya metam tarantite popa speaking well you are out of maya but after that what you are what is your program after going out of maya what is your program what is your target that we like to know because even after going out of maya 
if there is no target in your life to serve Guru Vishnu Bhagavan, again problem. Either you can become Mayavadi or septic minded. Cannot say. Baba speaking, it is the main question, most vital question. After after going, after going out of Maya, what is your target? That we are interested to know. If Sadhu Guru Vaishnava Seva, Nam Seva is your target, then okay. But after going huh, out of Maya, you have no target, then you can become Mayavadi, fallen soul, septic minded, material mind. No guarantee. Without serving Guru Vaishnava, nobody can come out up to now. Up to now, not even a single, up to now, not even a single instant. Up to now, not even a single example, you can see me. That without pure Guru Vaishnava Seva, somebody going out of, somebody going, on, going out of Maya or uh, Successful in bhajan, nobody. People are interested about their, people are always interested about their own benefit. They are always busy with self-interest. They are always busy with self-interest. They like to understand the utility of the object. They want to understand the utility of the object up their bhajan. They are doing mani bhajan. Bhajan means seva. As per our Siddhanta. But they, idiot people, they say, Popa speaking, they are using this word seva. We are serving dog, we are serving cow, you know, we are serving, you know, poor people. Papa speaking, this Seva, this word is not applicable everywhere. Seva, this word is not applicable. Dog Seva, poor man Seva, horse Seva. Seva, this word is not applicable everywhere. Seva is only applicable for Guru, Vishnu, Bhagavan, Dham, Nam, I mean Aprakita. If they can understand the utility, uh, utility of bhajan, then they can do. If they can understand the utility of Krishna, utility of bhakti, Krishna prem, what is the utility? We understand the utility of money, position, that we are doing. But we, have, we don't understand what we can do. Even those who are coming in bhajan, they are thinking, Always thinking about profit and loss account. So for them, Ratha Yatra Usab is useless. Ratha Yatra is useless for the what they can do. Ratha Yatra one exclusive festival. That's why I started with the sloka, first sloka. What is that? Popa used to say. Gauriya Bhajan, what do you mean by Gauriya Bhajan? Gauriya Bhajan means top to bottom. You will have to cry. Gauriya Bhajan means Vipralamba Bhajan. Gauriya Bhajan means Vipralamba Bhajan. I mean, you will have to cry day and night. Cry for whom? For Bhagavan, the Absolute. Guru Vaishnava Bhagavan. But Gaurkishwar Bhaji Maharaj speaking, they cannot bear even one penny loss. Those who cannot bear even one penny loss, they like to do Raganuga Bhajan, Prupanuga Bhajan. How funny! Those who cannot bear even one penny loss, always calculating profit and loss. Gauriya Bhajan is not for them. Gauriya Bhajan is not for them. 
Bangshidat Babaji Maharaj used to say, Bangshidat Babaji Maharaj used to say, that sometimes somebody is singing very nice kirtan. Somebody sometimes doing nice kirtan of Vipralamba, especially those Sahajiyas. But Bangshidat Babaji Maharaj speaking, you are only singing. You are on this singing without any realization. But those who are sadhu, those who are sadhu, they are going to break their heart. Tumito gaiyai gala, jar phatlo tar phatlo in Bengali. Tumito gaiyai gala, you are only singing. But those who are elevated devotee having vipralamba baba, that their heart is going to crack, break down. Follow. One devotee from Santipur, one devotee from Santipur coming here in Godru to do Hari Bhajan. And that devotee is speaking to Gorkhisar Bhaji Maharaj, I like to do bhajan with you. Gorkhisar Bhaji Maharaj, I am not doing bhajan, I don't understand bhajan. Babaji Maharaj knows he is rascal. Where is your bhajan kuti? I make bhajan kuti there. Nice. Oh, yeah. You are alone? No, I am not alone. I have my wife with me. You are saying separately or together? But actually, separately. Okay. That's when you are uh, interested to follow what uh, is called Bana Prastha. Actually, I'm following Bhana Prasad, actually. Separately, we have to. And, and taking prasadam? Prasadam together. Prasadam together. Who is cooking? My wife cooking. Your wife cooking. You are not cooking. Your wife cooking, yes. Today, what do you take? Brinjal fry and some different kind of preparation speaking. Babaji Ma laughing and speaking. You are already getting the association of your wife. Now we are saying separately. Separately saying, through your cooking, nice tasteful, chana rasa, you know, these, that, brinjal fai, moong dal. Your wife, you are getting the association of your wife. This way Babaji Ma is speaking. It is quite impossible. Bonded soul, it is very, really dangerous. Hari Bhajan is not a matter of joke. Many times, devotees, they used to ask to go to Sarbhaj Maharaj, how we can get Krishna? Can you speak, uh, can you speak some way of the procedure, how we can do bhajan, how we can get Krishna, you can speak. Gaurakrishnar Bhaji Maharaj used to give one, only one answer. Only one answer. Try to cry for Krishna. You are crying for money, for wife, children, property loss. You are crying, no? So you try to cry for Krishna day and night. You can get Krishna. Only one answer. If you can cry for Krishna day and night, then you can get Krishna. Otherwise, no. Raja King Maninda Chandra. King Maninda Chandra, Rai. He is requesting go to Sir Bajma. Could you please come and stay in my bhajan, in my uh, palace here? There in Murshidabad. Could you please come? I like to get your association. Could you please come and stay in my palace, nice place? Bajma laughing. If I go to your palace, after watching the glamorous situation all around, you have your wife and everything, so I can feel greedy, so I can, some litigation can start. Some litigation can start. So better you can come here, I can make one bhajan kuti for me, near me, near my bhajan kuti, it's more practical. Because you are inviting me there in palace, 
If I go there, you have beautiful wife, everything. All your palaces, you know, decorated, majestic arrangement there. After watching and living there, I can get habituated there. So then I can start litigation court case with you. So better you can come here, more practical. I can make one bhajan kutir. I also like to get your association, you come here. Babaji Maharaj, follow. This is called bhajan. Actually, to understand what is going I am not making any story. Somebody can feel sorry, but I cannot speak lie. That is the main problem. If I could make some false philosophy, eh, then it would have been uh, better for you. Because people like to hear false philosophy. To understand what is Gauriya Bhajan, life after life we will have to wait. I am not Sahajiya. I can see I can give, make you gopi overnight. You can start doing bhajan. Follow. Somebody going to inform Santoguchi Maharaj. Very tough. In front of me here in Rudadip, Maharaj came. He used to love me very much. Somebody speaking, Maharaj, that devotee doing, you know, Rupanuga bhajan, he like to become gopi. Santama speaking, you bring to me, you bring him to me, I can make him gopi overnight by beating him. Santama used to say, you bring to me, bring near me. I can beat him and overnight I can make him, make operation and make him gopi overnight. <laughs> Santama used to say. So we are not Sahajiya. Actually, the sloka I started with is very important. So, I mean, in whole Chaitanya Charitamrita's whole Bhagavatam, this is the core part. Core part, you know, core, inner part. Very sacred. Priyo Swayam Krishna Sahachari Kurukhyatta Milito Sha Aham Radha Tadidam Sangama Sukham. This slok, when when and how Radharani spoke? Actually, it was a painful history, painful situation. After bearing long separation, Brajagopikas, Radharani, they are going, almost going to die. They are almost going to die. End point. They cannot live anymore. They cannot live anymore. But still they are living. That is the miracles. Because in Chaitanya Charitamrita, you all read, but you are blind. You overlook. That's why under the guidance of Guru Vishnu, we will have to read. In Chaitanya Charitamrita, so many terms there, you can overlook. Oh, you can read and cross. But you don't know what. Very most important, this thing. What is that? Krishna Kavidas Goswami writing Jodi hoi jog, na hoi biyog. Because many times before I told one, one very important word. Na vipralamhena sambhagam asnute. Without the pralambha, sambhog, milan, not possible. No vi pralamena, sambhagam asnute. You cannot realize, you cannot get the taste of milan if there is no at all vi pralambha. But in our life, vi pralambha there. But for material father, mother, wife, children, money, position, we have also Vipralam. Not that we don't have Vipralam. You can look inside your heart, you have Vipralam. Maybe past some incident happened, Vipralam, you are feeling pain. But you don't know that Vipralam can put you into the ocean of misery. It, it can take you into hell. Vipralamba must be there. In whole society you ask. 
some or other way, Viparamba coming. Because it is material Viparamba. Somebody going to miss wife, somebody going to miss husband, somebody going to miss you know, children, father, mother, friend. They are crying. They are crying. Crying for why? For separation. They are feeling pain. They are feeling pain, being, being, being separated from their near and dear one. Being separated from their near and dear one, they are feeling pain. They are crying day and night. Because there was Milan. There was Milan, no? Huh? Mother crying for boy, because boy now gone from this world. Because boy and mother, there was a strong relationship. Milan, loveful relation, face to face, front to front. All loveful relation. So now, mother crying for the boy. Because there was Milan. Mother could realize the utility of the boy. Mother could realize the utility of the boy. It's my boy. Could realize. They all stayed together, mother and children, you know, boy, they stayed together. There was Milan. Milan mean Unification. Milan mean all loveful relation with each other physically. Milan. Physically. That's called Mira. But that mother not crying for another boy who is just neighbors. Another mother going to lose his father, going to lose his son. But this mother surely not going to cry for them. You try to understand the miracle. That that mother who is crying for his own own boy. But surely that mother not crying for the, uh, the other boy who is just staying nearby, I mean adjacent, neighbors. One, one mother, another mother going to lose his son. I know myself. Young boy, 35 years, very nice looking, fall down from the bus, brain hemorrhage, die. He was the disciple of Bhaman Goswami Maharaj. Follow. I know Nilmani Bhagriyastha used to live in Calcutta. This way, if you never have any, if you have never any relationship with Guru Vishnu Bhagavan, this way, if you have never in a no relationship, yeah, if you have no relationship with Guru, Vaishnava, Bhagavan, Dham, Nam, then there is no question of any Vipralamba. You never meet, no? You have never, you know, felt, you have never felt any relationship, you know, with Guru, Vaishnava, Bhagavan. No rapful relation with Guru, Vaishnava, Bhagavan. That's why you are not crying. So, Ratra Yatra is surely not for me, because I am busy with material things. Ratha Yatta is specially for those Brajavasis. For them, Ratha Yatra Chariot Festival is very important. I can come to the point, very important point. After long separation, it is unbearable. Unbearable, almost next to impossible. But if you put question, if you put question in front of me, Maharaj, if it is really unbearable, impossible, next to impossible to bear the separation of Krishna, then how Radharani living, Gopika is living, is absurd, not absurd, not absurd. There is also some some mystery. What is that mystery? If Bhagavan Sri Krishna 
if Krishna going to if Krishna going to get information that Radharani going to die, Radharani already die, then Krishna cannot die. If Krishna going to get information, Radha already died, then Krishna cannot live. Immediately Krishna can die. For this reason, those Bhajagopikas and Radharani, somehow they like to check their life. A another very important issue, which you never think, which you never think. What is that? You can remember, Previous, previous, previous Kartik, I, I, I was, you know, that time I recited Gopi Gita. Toi dhita, toi dhita sabu, twang bichin mate. There is one. Chayati te dikam janmana brajo sreyata indira. Shashadatrahi Daita Dikshutam Dikshutavaka Toidhita Shabo Pang Bichin Bate. You can recite, you can, you can learn from me how to recite. That you can learn somehow. But you cannot understand the you cannot understand the inner meaning. You cannot understand the inner meaning. Follow. It's very nice. A Gopi Gita, if you recite, because this Gopi Gita, by reciting this, this particular, this Gopi Gita, by reciting Gopi Gita, King Prataparuddha was successful to get one embrace of Mahaprabhu. Don't forget. Mahaprabhu never touch any Never see, never look at any woman or look at any king or material person. Follow. But the king was great devotee. But Mahaprabhu cannot break his rules and regulations. Then Sarvam Vartaja Jokasi Misro, they are all planning how to arrange your meeting how to arrange your meeting with Mahaprabhu? How to arrange your meeting? Actually, Bhagavan sitting inside heart. Bhagavan sitting inside heart, na? So, Bhagavan giving inspiration to Sarvam Vatajajo. You give the plan this way so that, that, so that king can meet with me. Mahaprabhu sitting inside the heart of Kasimisra of Sarvam. Otherwise, how it was possible for, for, for Sarvam Vatajajo to immediately Calculate. Well, you don't cry, don't worry. I can arrange your meeting. But you, how you can meet? How I can meet? Prabhu never meet with king. And, uh, eh? Prabhu can deliver the whole world except me. Patabrudha lamenting. Patabrudha lamenting and crying and speaking. So I think Prabhu appear in this world to deliver everybody except Patabrudha. He lamenting. Then, by the inspiration of Gauranga Mahaprabhu, Sarvam Vataja is going to make one plan. Well, don't worry. After Rathi Yatra, I mean pulling chariot, Prabhu and his de all devotees, they can go in Chagannath Ballab Udwan garden and Prabhu can lie down on the ground under a tree to take, you know, nice cold water. I know, cold wind. In that case, Prabhu can lie. You can change your dress in plain dress, like ordinary man. You can go and try to message the lotus feet of Prabhu. Ah, Prabhu, if Prabhu become angry, Prabhu cannot know. Prabhu out of Baba can lie down on ground thinking about the people of Baba. And of Krishna, immediately you can go and recite Jayati te dikam janmana braja sat indira shashadatrahi daita dikshatam dikshatavaka 
Tvaidhitashabho Tvam Vichinbhati What is the last line? What is the last line? Ashobho If you know Sanskrit, then you can understand Shand, water, life They are never using singular number Always plural Follow? Plural number, not singular number, not applicable. So, ashobu. Toi dhita ashobu. Also, another meaning, five, five air we have. Pancha pran bayu. Five different kind of apan, pans, uh, you know, uh, you know, uh, pran, apan, udan, saman, ban, or five different kind of. Our life is, you know, working five. So also you can use this way. Anyway, so toi dhisa sabo, toi dhito ashabo, toi toi mane. Our life is. What is the question? If they are almost going to die, then why they are not dying? Now I am giving to get answer. What is the answer? Gopika giving, Radharani or Gopika is giving this answer. How we can die? We are almost dead body, but we cannot die because our life is resting until your lotus feet. Our life, all our life is resting until your lotus feet. Toi dhita sabo twang bichin bate. We are searching you and our life is resting until your lotus feet. And you are the source of Amrita. You are the source of Amrita, na? You don't know? Bhagavan is Amrita. Madhu, Bhagavan Madhu, na? in Veda, different places of Madhu, 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 Om Madhu, Madhu. Adharam Madhuram, Badanam Madhuram, Madhura Dhipate Rakhilam Madhuram. Madhu, Madhu means Amrita. And Bhagavan himself told in 10th canto, Mai Bhakti Hi Bhutanam Amrita Tai Kalpate. Those who love me, serve me, have a loveful relation, they are getting Amrita. So, if Amrita is there, even if, if, if in heavenly planet, if they are, if they are in heavenly planet, those demigods, they are getting the facility to drink Amrita, material Amrita. By churning the Kira Sagar, by churning the Kira Sagar, that Amrita was derived and that Amrita is there with Indra. They are drinking Amrita. If that Amrita can give you a long life, but still that Amrita is not actual Amrita. That is not actual Amrita. Bhagavan only wanted to clarify this point. Because you know, long ago, I was discussing about the glorification of Bhagavatam. When Indra, Barun, they came, to take Bhagavad Amrita in exchange of another Amrita available in heaven, which they wanted to grant for, grant for Parikhit Mara. Indra, Barun, they are all coming. Indra, Barun from heaven, they are coming in front of Sukhadev Goswami and going to suggest, why not, why not, why not to, why not, why not to give, we can give Amrita. We can give to uh, Parikshit and that Amrita, Bhagavad Amrita, you can give to us. Shukdev Goswami was very angry. Shukdev Goswami was very angry to hear this kind of exchanging, exchanging mood. By hearing this kind of exchange, business mood. Exchanging mood, but business mood. What? You like to give this Amrita to Parikshit? And you like to give this Amrita? Are you can say, Maharaj, you, we also like to drink this Amrita. That is okay. You could say that, Maharaj, we are coming, we also like to drink this Amrita. That is okay. But you cannot exchange. One diamond cannot be exchanged with one coal. Coal, charcoal. Try to understand what is the foolishness. One man having diamond, you are going to bring some coal, black coal. Ah, Maharaj, I can give this coal. I can. 
rascal. How possible? How valuable this, you know? Is possible? Never possible? This is the mood. This is the mood of Indra Varun. Parikhit Maharaj was very angry. And even Parikhit Maharaj did even Parikhit Maharaj didn't think it necessary to give reply. Even Parikhit Maharaj did even even Sukhdev Goswami, sorry. Even Sukhdev Goswami didn't think it necessary to give reply to their question. Because he wanted to avoid the association. But well, foolish. You could say that we like to hear Ambit. How you are going to exchange? Then Sukhdev Goswami was very angry and he wanted to pass one remark. What is that? What is that? Shakarje Kushala Sura. Shakarje Kushala Sura. They are very clever. They are businessmen. Shakarje Kushala Sura Mane. They are very, very clever, like crow and jackal. Shakarje Kushala. How to how to get benefit, they know very well. But Shukdev Goswami didn't think it necessary to speak with those non devotees. Huh? What is this? I can give this kind of Amrita to Parikshit, who is my disciple, who is inclined unto my lotus feet. Pari Come on, Parikshit Ma. Parikshit Ma already you know, inclined unto the lotus feet of Shukdev. He left everything body, everything, all related thing only with the body coming. And all the way to submit. And how Sukhdev Goswami can throw him out? Not possible. So, the answer you know, Gopika speaking, Toi dhita shabo twang bichin bate. We are searching you, whole night here and there, where you are, where you are, Gopi Gita. And we are almost, uh, at that end point of our life, almost, almost going to die, deadline. But still we are not, still we are not dying. Why you know? Because our life is resting until your lotus feet. So your lotus feet is the source of Amrita. So how we can die? Another point, if you are going to get information, rather going to die, you can die. So Gopikas, they are always searching the benefit of Krishna. At any cost, at any cost they like to, at any cost they like to arrange the situation in such a way that Krishna can feel happy. Even in dream you cannot imagine. You can hear this philosophy, but you can, even in dream you cannot realize. You will have to go. Do bhajan and go up to that. This life you can do, if you are sincere. If you are sincere, this life you can do, not next life. So how I can explain in front of you? Any amount of lecture, any amount of philosophy not sufficient to clarify this point in front. Until and unless you are 100% dedicated soul. Unto a lotus feet of one, Shatpur. Impossible. Rupa Nuga Bhajan, Raga Nuga Bha, Guru Dev. So there is two points. One is that if Krishna is going to hear the Radharani and Gopikas already died, then Krishna can immediately die. That's why they cannot be here. Even they are going to challenge their life. Even Gopikas, they are going to challenge their life to save Krishna. To give complete satisfaction to Krishna. That's why when Krishna was sick, nobody giving the dust particle from the lotus feet of devotees. Go because they come on. How, how many, you, how, how much you need to take? We like to go to hell. If Krishna is happy, if Krishna is happy, then we are ready to go to hell forever. It's called Raganuga Bhajan. It's called Rupa Nuga Bhajan. You cannot remember, I told many times, this is the mood of Radharani, Popa told, I can come down to any level for the actual seva, I mean preaching of Gauranga. It's called Radharani Bhav, Bhav of Radharani. You cannot realize. 
So, Sriman Mahaprabhu is going to express the same mood. Because Radharani is there, going to still, eh, still the mood and Baba of Radharani, na? body complexion, everything. So, with Radha mood, same, same thing you can see in front of Jagan. I can come to this point. First of all, I like to clarify what happened after long separation. What happened after long separation when those Brajavasis got information, Krishna is coming uh, nearby. Kurukshetra. Oh, Kurukshetra. Kurukshetra, Kurukshetra, I've been to 25, 30 years back. Th maybe more than that. 30 years back, I went to Kurukshetra. After that, no time. While going, while going to Punjab, Jalandhar, uh, you have to cross this station. I went there. That is the same spot where Krishna, uh, you know, Krishna gave advice to Arjun at the same spot. Krishna delivered lecture to Gita, to Arjun, that same spot. Same Badrakali in front of whom Jarabharat was taken for sacrifice. That Kali, black, I went there, nearby. I went there in the Brahma Kunda, where Parshuram wanted to kill all Kshatriya and by using their blood he wanted to make one lake, big lake. Kurukshetra. If you go to if you go through Gita Provochan is translate I don't know if some translated or not. Somebody translating Upadeshamrita, Gita not yet. Then you can understand. For the long time I was explaining only Dharma Khetya, Kurukshetra, Samaveta, Judu Sabaha, this only one sloka for a long time. If you go, you can go mad. So deep philosophy here. Oh, we don't understand. Ah, the Kurukhetra is very important place. Very important place. There is a benediction by demigods. Somebody going to live, you know, in Kurukhetra, they can get, you know, they can go to heaven also. And in Kurukshetra, Krishna came from Darika. From Darika, Krishna and the Darika Vashi, all those living Jadubamsi, those who are Jadubamsa, all they are living, all they have, all they came up to Kurukshetra. For one Jagya, that was a special fe festival, festival Jagya. There was Solar eclipse, Surya Parag. As a, there was a big festival there, festival of Jagya. They arranged one big Jagya, and and uh, you know solar eclipse. That time Krishna invited everybody, all from three worlds, they all demigods, everybody coming, kings all over the world, they going to join. They are arranging big festival. Follow the festival. That time, Brajavasi wanted to come here to meet with Krishna. Because there is a neutral point, no? Because it is not possible for Brajagopikas and Radharanis to go up to Darika. It is, it is called breakage of rasava. Rasa, feeling of rasa can break up. So they cannot go. Is how they can go? Krishna is now married. All uh, you know, sixteen thousand one hundred eight wives are there. How possible? Well, it's it is a, it is an intersection. It is the intersection of rasa. It's called the intersection of rasa because there is separate rasa. There is separate. Rasa. It's not possible for other end to go there. No, not possible. Oh, okay. Midway, 
Midway they can come, okay? Midway. So when they got information that uh, Krishna coming, that they took decision, well, we can also go to have a look at his lotus feet. Actually, Brajavasis, they were not invited. For this Jagya, for this Jagya, 14 worlds were invited. But Brajavasi, they were not invited. Why? Why? Because if somebody is going to marry, surely not going to invite father and mother, because it's home. Follow? It's home now. How I can invite father and mother there in the house? Marriage one, one boy is going to marry son. It is impractical to invite. Father and mother is a son. It's quite natural, they can say. Follow? So, Brajadam is the home of Krishna. Brajadam is the home. So, how possible that Krishna can invite his father? So that's why it's impractical. So, Radharani on Bhajagopikas, all they wanted to meet with Krishna. That was a big history. I don't like to go in details. It will take long time. Now, long, you know, Jasudama, Nanda Bhava, all Brajagopika, they are all full proofs. They are going to meet with Krishna there. A fear with a strong feeling of separation. Long history. I am going to cut short. When Jasodama crying, when Jasodama crying that to meet with Krishna, Krishna and Balaram, they too were busy to offer oblation. I mean fire sacrifice. But when Jasodama cried like mad, Krishna Balaram could not stay. Immediately stand up. They become restless. They wanted to search out the reason for why we are feeling so. They could realize our mother Jasuda crying. After that, when Radharani, because they are meeting in separate, separate places, surely Radharani cannot meet in front of everybody. Some messenger there, information were sent to Krishna, you know, Radharani and all Lalita, Vishaka, all Brajagopika, they are waiting for you there. Finally, Krishna very secretly came there to meet with them with, with bent head, bent head, sugging out of sight because they are feeling no pain. When coming in from the Radharani, Radharani bursted into tears. All Brajagopikas, all Lalita, Vishaka, they massive. They started coming, crying like mad. They cannot see Krishna. Krishna also crying. Sweet relationship. Brajagopika is going to put some allegation against Krishna. How it is possible for you to stay with, you know, there in Dharoka, leaving us. Krishna is going to give, give answer. Not possible for me. Don't think it is possible for me to stay in Dharaka leaving you all. You can ask. You can ask what is happening there in Dharaka. When I am sleeping, all my bed is full of tears. Full of tears, full of tears. I cannot sit in my, I cannot sleep in my bed. All, you know, Rukkini, Satyabhama asking, what happened to you? What happened to who? Who has done some wrong so that you are crying? I cannot give answer because this is very secret issue. How I can? They cannot understand. Even I cannot sleep at night time. All the time I, my bed become one pool of tears. You think I am living very happily there in Dharaka? Not that. My heart and soul, they are in Vrindavan with you. Rather than saying, I don't like to hear any argument. Only you will have to promise me that you can come to Vrindavan. 
I don't like to hear any argument because our life is extreme point. You are going to give argument. You are sending messenger, Uddha, to give us consolation. You are going to teach us Jnana Yoga. How possible, how funny. Radharani is going to complain. You don't feel shy? You don't feel shy? You are sending, uh, you are sending Uddha to teach us Jnana Yoga? Whereas we like to forget you. We like to forget you. We cannot live. All the time your memory is there. You are going to teach us Jnana Yoga by the help of Uddha. How funny it is. How we can? We, we like to forget you. We cannot live without you all the time your pictures. And you like to teach us Jnana Yoga by the help of which we can remember you. It is your... Eh? You can speak. You can speak some formula. We like to know some way out. How to forget you. You are going to teach our Jnana Yoga to us by the help of Uddha. Ultimately, Radharani is going to lose all patience, blasted into tears and speaking. I don't like to hear any argument. You will have to go to Vrindavan. If you go, then I can think your kipa is full kipa on us. Radharani is speaking. In Chaitanya Charitamrita, Chaitanya Charitamrita is so high. Chaitanya Charitamrita is so high that even those who can realize Bhagavatam's a little bit, they can not understand. Chaitanya Charitamrita is so high. High philosophy. Anir hidai mon, mor mon bindavan, mone mone ekkori mani. Anir hidai mon, Mormon Bindavan, Bengali. Anir Hidayamon, Mormon Bindavan. Mone Bone Akkori Mani. Taha Tomar Charanad Dai Jodikara Udai, Tobe Tomar Purna Kipa Mani. Bengali. But Niktar, Niktar. Yet to learn, learn. Otherwise, you cannot get. Radharani is speaking to Krishna. For other people, what is there in their mind, their heart. But my but my heart and Bindavan but my heart and Bindavan is same. For other people, what is their heart, their mind and heart there. But not that case. My whole entire heart, my entire heart, there is no space. My entire heart, there is no space. You cannot find any space. All Vrindavan, totally Vrindavan. And Radharani crying and speaking, for other people, their heart and mind, they are something else. But my heart and Vrindavan, not different from each other. What is Vrindavan? That is my heart. What is my heart? That is my Vrindavan. I like to see your lotus feet. I like to see your lotus feet again there in Mindavan. Then I can realize you have full kipa on us, otherwise not. We like to see your lotus feet there in Mindavan, otherwise we cannot live. We don't like to live. You can go or not. We like to see your lotus feet there again inside Vrindavan because outside Vrindavan we cannot live. Krishna also same, but still it is one kind of lila. Nandanandan Krishna can never go out of Vrindavan. Nandanandan Krishna can never go out of Vrindavan. It's quite impossible, next to impossible. Then how possible Krishna going outside? Not Krishna not going. Nanda Nanda Krishna not going. You have wrong information. You have wrong information. Nanda Nanda Krishna not going. Jasudha Nanda Krishna going. Nanda Nanda Krishna never going out of Vrindavan. To increase, to increase the Vipralamba Bhava, 
it, it is one kind of pastime. Krishna want to see, Krishna want to see, Krishna want to get the test, Krishna want to get the test of that Vipralambha, of Radharani, Lolita, Vishakha, they are Vipralambha, Baba, how much, how far, how testy, I'll have to see. That's why Nandanand and Krishna, they are inside Vindavan, but in hiding. This kind of argument, Krishna speaking to Radharani. When Krishna, when Radharani not at all ready to hear anything, Krishna with folded hands speaking. You speak, you speak one thing. Whenever you cry, um, you, you are going to die. When you remember me, you cannot get my association. You speak yes or not. You can see me inside Vindavan. But you don't believe that I am physically present. You think it is one kind of manifestation only. Krishna with folded hands speaking to Radharani. You speak true. You speak the truth. Whenever you are feeling strong, separate, almost going to die, you cannot find me. You cannot see me. You cannot discover me inside Vindavam, physically. But you think it is one kind of manifestation. You don't think that Krishna physically present. I am physically present. Sometime Radharani, in the name of, in Vrindavan forest, Radharani crying and crying, suddenly watch one Tamal Viksha. Ah, that Krishna. Like crazy, crazy. Radharani Baba is like infinity ocean. Bonded soul, teeny soul, what they can realize? Teeny soul. How they can realize? Radharani Baba is an infinity ocean. Infinity ocean. When what kind of Baba appear, Krishna cannot understand. Hare, just now, Krishna is there standing here with Radharani. Ah, where is Krishna? I started crying. Krishna is there, beside. Krishna standing, but still, where Krishna, why Krishna gone? Started. This is a crazy bar. In Brahma Gita, we have no right to go to Brahma Gita. Otherwise, I could explain. Different kind of power. Infinity power. Infinity power. When what kind of Baba appearing in Vrindavan forest, sometime watching on Tamal Briksha, ah, I get Krishna here, embrace. How painful. Sometime rather than speaking to Lalita, I think we are hopeless condition. Lalita, we think we are hopeless condition, we cannot get Krishna. So when Krishna can come, I don't know. When Krishna can come, maybe he cannot discover me in this body. I can die. And you cannot burn my body. You can put my body there in Vrindavan and in Vrindavan Krishna can watch me. I can serve Krishna. All my water part of my body can go into water. Light part of my body can go into light. Follow. All Panchabhuta, all Panchabhuta, in the form of Panchabhuta, maybe I cannot live. Rather than speaking, maybe I cannot live with this body, in this body. But we know Radharani and his body same. But still Radharani lamenting like that. Not that Radharani and his body is separate, not that. But still, the sea is being like that. Maybe I am going, not going to live in this body, but still, at least I can get the scope to, to distribute my five elements into five elements of this nature. When Krishna can come, can take bath in water, I can serve Krishna in the form of water. When Krishna can come in, you know, in air to get you know, nice, yeah, I can serve Krishna in the air. 
So five elements. This is the point. So, Prabhupada many times used to speak one sloka spoken by Radharani. Ahus chate nalina nabo pada rabindu yogi swarir hidi vichinta magad bodhir sangsara kupapati tauttarana uttarana balammanam geham jusam upi manasi udyat sadano. Follow. Ahus chate nalina nava padar bindu joge sware ridhi vichinta magad bodhoir. How nice loka. Who can hear this kind of cream, Amrita? Prabhupada used to shed tears at the bank of Radha Kund and used to explain this loka. At the bank of Radha Kund. Prabhupada used to shed tears. And used to speak this way. Ahus chate nali nanava padara bindo joge swarair hri vichinta magad bodhair sangshar kupapatito tarana balamman geham jusa mopi manasi udiyat sadana. Radharani ultimately fed up. Radharani ultimately fed up and speaking. Speaking to Krishna. Those who are jogi. They are going to confine your lotus feet in their heart. They are concentrating. They are always concentrating onto your lotus feet. Yoga Swarai, Yoga Ishwara, not ordinary yogi. Radhani wanted to mean about Vaishnavanam Jatha Sambhu. Be careful. So, rather I wanted to give indicate. So, Yogeswari Hridhi Vichinta Magad Bodhi, which is uh, your lotus feet. Your lotus feet. Your lotus feet is the is is only property. Your lotus feet, your lotus feet is the only property in infinity world. What other property you mean? Building, savings money, ornament, you think? What do you think? Foolish man, what do you think? Is there any other property? You can show me. There is so many property, Maharaj. You can show me. Actually, property is one and single. Property is one and single and it is so valuable that in infinity world nobody there to pay. Only Radharani and Gopikas can pay. That's why Bhagavan Sri Krishna was bound to speak. No pare aham niravadda sangyujam vibhuda yusapibha jama abhajano durjana griho singhala sangvrishya tadava pratujati sadhuna. This who told? Krishna told. I cannot pay you. I cannot pay you. It's impossible for me to pay to you all. Gopikas, you get satisfied by your own highness. You try to get satisfied by your own highness. I have nothing to pay to you. What I can pay? What I can pay? I have nothing to pay. Krishna speaking, even if I am going to get the lifespan, Krishna speaking, even if I am going to get the lifespan like a demigod, still, still, that much time is also, that much time is also useless for me. That much time is also useless for me, even I am going to live just like a demigod, one kalpa, still I cannot pay you. The way, you are, the way you are going to dedicate everything unto my lotus feet for infinity period, I am always indebted to you. Indebted. For infinity period. Not that after one crore's years I can pay you. For infinity period, I cannot pay you. Bhagavan Sri Krishna surrendered. Bhagavan Sri Krishna surrendered in front of Radharani and Gopikas. I surrender you. All my commitment in Gita, 
all my commitment in Gita, ye yathamam prapadyanti tang sasiva bhajamyaham, all failure I am. I am failure in front of you. Now you understand. Who is Gopika? Who is Radharani? So, Radharani ultimately, after meeting, going to come back, fed up Radharani. And finally speaking, Ahuschate narino nava padara binda joge sware hridi vichinta magada bodhi shangsara kupo potito tarano valamman geham jusam opi manasi udhyat sadhana. At least you can do some kripa. We are grihastha. We are busy with homely jobs, homely seva. But we don't like to forget you. All the time we like to see your lotus feet confined inside our heart. That is our prayer. So same feeling. So many things I like to speak, but time cannot permit. So many, it's ocean actually, ocean. Our Gauranga Mahaprabhu is going to cry and speak in front of Jagannath. If I like to speak about Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, what happened, it will take and, uh, some long time. Now Chaitanya Mahaprabhu with this mood, in front of Jagannath crying, Vrindavane Chalo Jai Jagannath, our Guru Padma Madhugusi Maharaj, they used to cry and cry and say, Vrindavane Chalo Jai Jagannath, under the guidance of Radharani. How miracle! Sadhu Sangha, how miracle! Don't forget! You like to pick up some enmity with Guru Vaishnava? You're so foolish. You don't know. If you love them, you can get the immense treasure. But you unnecessarily going to challenge them. You like to fight with them. Unless they, you like to uh, approach them in fighting mood, but they are not here in the material world. They are always busy with the nectarian feeling. Like Gauranga Mahaprabhu speaking. Yesterday I told them one sloka. I told today I can explain. See Chaitanya Padam Bujo Madhupe Bhyo Namo Namaha Kathanchit Asrayat Jesam Shaupi Tan Gutat Gandhavag Bhavet. What is the sloka? Today if I explain it's appropriate. All Gauranga Parshad. Prabhupada, Bhakti, Takur, Madhav Goswami Maharaj, Keshav Goswami Maharaj, oh, the full troops, all deputed personalities. Deputed by whom? Bhagavan Sri Krishna. But you are going to criticize them. They are all deputed personalities. Deputed by Gauranga, Prabhupada told. Selected. Prabhupada many times told. But people criticizing them. Very shortly, I am going to publish one article about this. Very, I wrote it two, three times. First, I wrote in Bengali, it's very dangerous. In Bengali, very dangerous. If you are triple MA in Bengali, still you will have to do bhajan, then you can realize. I can give you that book. You can read and go mad. After that, I started writing. But after writing, I was not satisfied. Again, I like to add something, again change, again rewrite. Now it's okay. <laughs> because I like to get the best, you know. Like Prabhupada started writing the commentary of Janma Dasha in a very solitary place. But one day night, Prabhupada discovered all the manuscripts gone. Morning time, Baba said, where is the manuscript gone? Cannot see. Prabhupada was very anxious. That time, Prabhupada started writing the alone in, in a place very near to Krishnanagar. From Krishnanagar, they have to go. That place. After that, Prabhupada started writing again. But Prabhupada was not so happy. The first writing was more. But finally, after the writing is over, some devotee discovered that the mouse 
taken that bundle of paper into some useless, it become useless. Big mouse, big mouse. Big mouse taking the whole bundle, bundle of papers and going in, in a drain, gone. It was discovered. <laughs> Follow. This is the condition. So, so what, what I mean to say, all the devotees of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, they are all like honeybees. They are all hovering around the lotus feet of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu to get the nectar. To get the nectar. Because honeybees, why they are hovering around? To get honey. No other purpose. To get honey, no? Sri Chaitanya Padambuja Madhu Pebhya Namo Nama. We are going to pay Dandavat unto the lotus feet of each of those honeybees. Those who are busy to collect the nectarian nectar from the lotus feet of Chaitanya honey. We are going to pay Dandavat unto the lotus feet of each of them. Sri Chaitanya Padambuja Madhu Pebhya Namo. Because what do you speak about human being? Even a dog, Shao Pitat Gandhavak Bhabe. Even one dog can get the smell of the lotus feet of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, if at all that dog somehow going to take shelter of one such honeybees. Like Sivananda said. One dog took shelter of Sivananda. You can remember, no? One dog, all the way, going up to Puri. He got the lotus feet of Gauranga. My Guru Patan also used to give some prasadam every day to that dog. Even Akadashi day, Akadashi prasadam. Every day, Guru Patan asked him, where the dog is after taking, used to give. Even Akadushi also. Not rice, Akadushi we have no rice. Some potato, this, there, so many things. So, if we are successful to take shelter unto the lotus feet of such a honeybees, who is oh, like a Guru Bhargava, hovering around the lotus feet of Gauranga, 100%, we can get the smell of the lotus feet of Gauranga. Don't worry. Be sincere, all this. Follow. So, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, I can take time someday to discuss this point. Today, time cannot permit. So, Gauranga Mahaprabhu is also going to express the same feeling as was expressed by Radharani. As was expressed by Radharani, I was explaining for a long time. Same feeling we can see inside Gauranga Mahaprabhu. But nobody can realize. Only Sarup Gosai can realize and by chance Rupa Goswami Pad was there that particular year. Rupa Goswami Pad was there with Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. He could realize. He could realize why, why Prabhu going to sing this way? Why Prabhu going to sing this song? What is the reason? Sarup Gosai could realize and accordingly, Swarup Goswami started singing and dancing. Mahaprabhu dancing. Full Vipralamba Baba. Oh, Mahaprabhu is like fire, fire brigade man, you know, water coming. Fire brigade man, of water coming from here. It is written. I am not making a story. All around those devotees, they are dancing. They are all getting the water from the Lotus-like eyes of Mahaprabhu. They are all, their, their clothes and everything wet. It is written. All around Mahaprabhu, those who are dancing, the water, from their water, by that water, they are also, they are going to get the clothes, everything wet. So can you imagine? Can you imagine? What kind of feeling? Prabhu, with this kind of feeling, dancing in front of Jagannath and going mad. And Jagannath also very clever, same. He is Jagannath, he is Jagannath. 
is going to stop the chariot somehow and going to watch this beautiful dancing and singing. When Jagannath don't like to move further, Jagannath is very much interested to see this, you know, dancing and singing. In that case, if you pull the, if you pull the chariot with full power, Jagannath cannot go. Jagannath cannot go. Full, if you apply full power, or if you apply any elephant, cannot go. Follow. This is about. Jagannath laughing and watching this. And this way, Mahaprabhu whole way. Oh, says, if I go on discussing about this, you know, Ratha Yatra festival, you can go mad. How? I am going to speak about my own feeling. Without feeling, I am not speaking. I have been there. Inside, the, in a cordon, inside, there is impossible, nobody can go. Just Jagannath here, I am here. So, by the mercy of Guru Vaishnava, I was feeling something important. Though not fully, I am a fallen soul. But still now I realize the mood of Guru Padma, the mood of Madhugusima, the mood of Prabhupada, Bhakti Mutakva. What is chariot festival? Rafi Yatra. How nice. Complete feeling you can get. That's why many times Bhakti Mutakur used to say. That's why many times Bhakti Mutakur used to say that Purushottam Dham is the topmost feeling of Vipralamba Khetra. Why and how? That I was discussing for a long time. Miracle. Bhakti Mantaku not speaking. Vrindavan is the topmost feeling of Vipralamba. Eh? People are in confusion. Bhakti Mantaku not speaking. Vrindavan is the topmost feeling of. No. Bhakti Mantaku speaking. Purushottam Dham. Sri Khetra. This is the topmost feeling of Vipralamba because he had Gauranga there. Exclusive Baba was expressed by Radharani. But here it is written by our Guru Bhargava. Whatever Baba was expressed by Radharani, he has some more special Baba. He has some more special Baba was expressed. Even inconceivable. Radharani impossible, that kind of Baba, same. Radharani is there. So here, first point, Radharani there. At the same time, he is Krishna himself. First point, the Baba, Baba of Radharani is stolen by Krishna. And Krishna himself wants to get the test. So, all together, combined, it becomes a big force. Even that kind of Baba was not available there. Like tortoise, like tortoise, all body, hand and leg, all enter into body. Prabhu become this size. How possible? Sometime, Prabhu becomes so tall, very bow, long, very, like ghost, all joint open, all oh, hand and leg. What is this? What is this miracle? All devotees become frightened. What is this? This kind of we never saw. Baba. Try to remember. Baba is the most important thing of our bhajan. No Baba attended no bhajan done. No Baba attended as yet no bhajan done. Baba is the vital. Still today, you can get the scope to hear about Prabhupada and Bhakti Mantra Guru. Try to, try to share this Harikatha. It is also Kipa. Try to share with... I know they cannot allow to play this Harikatha. I know, I am sure, but still. By the mercy of Nityananda Guranga, if somebody is going to hear, surely they can change their heart. They can get something Concrete, this, this much assurance I can give. Today I will have to stop, excuse me. So, Priyaha, 
Swayam Krishna Sahachari Kurukhetva Milita Shaham Radha Tadidam Sangama Sukham Tathapi Antaha Khelat Mamo Madhura Muroli Panchama Jushe Manu Me Kalindu Kalindi Pulino Vipinayo Sprihayati Vancha Galpatra Sikapa Sindhu Vipacha Pratitanu Pavan and Pavish. You big one, you bring one spoon. I cannot touch. He can, I, can do, I, I can distribute. I can distribute. You see. Try to go. Try to go deeply. It is my request. Try to go deep into this feeling. Otherwise, whole life you can miss. What to do? Leave everything. What is family? What is property? What do you kick out everything? Kick out and try to catch the lotus feet of Nityananda and Gauranga. It is my request. This life you can come out successful. This life. You need not wait. But if you make mistake, I have nothing to do. I can speak the way out. But bhajan you will have to do. Bhajan you will have to do. I can speak the way out. Under the guidance of Prabhupada Bhakti, that much against. So anyway, some 